<laughs> you better listen to me and stop being so hard-headed. What you want now? Let me tell you a thing or two. Okay, let me get this straight. <laughs> so you're trying to tell me you don't know what that's talking about. Okay, well here, here you go. <laughs> okay, I got you, I got you. I'm going to handle that for you. <laughs> you know, uh, Mama Bee was out here again, you know, looking at some bees. I saw a couple of funny bees out here, you know. They didn't kind of look like the normal bees. They look like imposters. But anyway, I decided to come on over here and take a break from uh, uh, playing with my bees and, and talk a little bit about this new show that's coming out. You know, it's called Preach. You know, and uh, this one clip is it's just pretty funny and it's pathetic at the same time. Um, I'm going to talk about the clip, but before we do that, we're going to roll the clip so y'all can see what Mama B talking about before I start talking about it. Roll the clip. When you get four confidences in a room, you better get ready because an explosion is going to happen. Ooh. Tonight is a night for people that are ready to receive hope. God, this is real. Come on! Oh! Move over, there's a prophet in the city. Boom. So, now you see this mess. You see this mess. You got these clowns up in here jumping around like they done lost their cotton picking mind. And they talking about they got the Holy Ghost and they talk about you get four prophets in the house. I mean, what the hell is she talking about? She don't know what she talking about. That ain't nothing but a clown show. That's why I don't nobody take none of that mess serious. Because you go there, you're jumping around, you got, you're blowing your breath in people's face. Let me tell you what. The reason why that one woman fell out is because... Uh, the woman's breath stank, okay? The the so-called prophet, her breath stank, okay? That's why she fell out. She didn't fall out because no Holy Ghost fell on her. I can guarantee you that. You see, these people are playing games with the Most High God of Heaven, and, and they think that he's going to bless them in that mess. No, no, no. You might you might appear to be blessed to people on the surface because you got you some little stupid show on television, but let me tell you something about, about that kind of stuff. When you get to playing with God, he gonna start playing back, but it ain't gonna be pretty. You see, because if you're truly his, he says, I chastise those whom I love. So you're gonna have to get yourself ready for some chastisement if you're gonna keep on clowning around and messing around and playing around with this thing, you see. Because back in the day when Mama B was coming up in church, none of that foolishness was going on. You see, because we didn't play that kind of stuff back in the day. You know, I wanna go back to the old landmark. But see, these people, they try to usher in this new mess where everything goes in the church. Stop calling it God's church and just call it your church because this mess ain't going to fly. You see what I'm saying? This is the biggest and best way to bring judgment down on you when you get to jumping around acting like a fool in the church. You see? And you got the kids watching. Kids don't know what's real because you got grown-ups like these women in this video. No folk falling all out in the floor playing games. You got folk like that. Who call themselves the representatives of God? You ain't no prophetess. Y'all in this for nothing but uh, prophesying and prophet lying for profit. That's it. You see? You know, Mama B finished with all of this now. I'm done with this topic. Uh, it ain't too much I can say because the foolishness speaks for itself. Mama B out. <laughs>